Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Lush Gardener. So this is an update video because a lot of you guys were asking me for another video on how the grey construction sand tends to work like. So this uh, clip was shot on 17th of uh, April 2023 and uh, these were some Graptosedum ghosti that I was repotting in the grey construction sand along with a uh, filtered garden soil. Uh, if you want to watch the entire video, I'll put the link in the description below because this is just an update video. So the grey construction sand is going to work similarly the same way how the aquarium sand tends to work or the river sand tends to work. For some people who are not able to uh, get the aquarium sand or river sand, grey construction sand is going to work out really well. Again guys, it's not necessary that you only have to go with these three types. You can go with any kind of, uh, uh, let's say, a sand any kind of sand whatever you find in your uh, environment or in your location as long as it is granular uh, anything if it is above 1 mm it is going to work out really well uh, as long as it's inorganic so it's going to work out really well you can use anything because even i didn't know about the gray construction sand earlier uh, this was just an experiment that i did because i myself was very skeptical about the gray construction sand i thought probably even after washing it might be a little dangerous for my succulents but i took that small risk and it turned out to be working out really well So here we are after I don't know how many months you can see this looks absolutely beautiful all my succulents are doing extremely well uh, they have been now introduced to morning direct sunlight for five to six hours because that's what Graptosedum ghosti love uh, that's when the colors will start to intensify on them and here we go this is our grey construction sand this was a decor piece that I had put in and you can see this is the grey construction sand very loose very porous works out really well just like how my aquarium sand and uh, or the river sand tends to work or sometimes when i go to my aquarium store a lot of times the uh, aquarium sand is out of stock and a lot of times i have to come back empty-handed but now luckily uh, i feel that the gray sand tends to work out really well i have used this multiple times and all of the times i've got a very good result with uh, the gray construction sand so i'm trying to uh, use this more in my uh, soil mix because it works out really well uh, one is that it's readily available i don't have to actually pay money for it uh, a lot of times after the construction is done uh, this sand is just scattered off and you all you have to do is just collect it and keep it together but then get it home filter it and wash it and then you can use it so it has been working out really well you can see uh, all of the succulents are wide open which means that they are uh, very the roots are very free in the soil uh, the soil also tends to dry really fast and uh, it's been working out really well you can just look at the succulent and you can get a fair idea of how well they are doing uh, so this is all about it guys uh, if you do not find anything if you have this option you can go with this uh, maybe there might be some other material that they are using uh, you can go with that as well in case if you do not find river sand but always remember if you're using river sand just give it one filter because a lot of times it does contain that fine uh, sand which we want to separate uh, which again is the same case with our gray construction sand it has that fine uh, powder that we need to separate before we use it for our succulents because you never know if you're just going to use it randomly uh, the garden soil might come in contact with that fine uh, dust and it can get compact and then it can cause problem to your succulent so just to be on the safer side filter whatever uh, gritty material you get just do one filter and that's going to work out really well so guys that's all about it i hope that this update video was helpful to you if it was please hit the like button and if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing to it until then take care stay safe and keep propagating